getting her looking crazy like that. Until I try to leave, something keeps pulling me back, me back, pulling me on me. Anyway, it's been a beautiful day. I give thanks today. I give thanks today. I give thanks today. It's a thankful day. It has nothing to do with the holiday because we know, you know, we all, those who know, know that it's a holiday. It's a lie. You can do what you want to with it, okay? But, you know, I'm not going to lie about it. Kids need to know the truth. Columbus wasn't a hero. And uh, a whole bunch of white people are lying to you. Take us. Take responsibility and accountability for what you do because your kids are catching hell because of you. Anyway, uh, just tell the truth. You know why the world's falling apart? Because you based it on lies. But anyway, I'm just on my walk. It's a beautiful day. I get thanks today, man. It's a gorgeous day. Gorgeous day. Thanks to my North Node who, uh, Confirms and affirms my way. You know, there are some people. Remember when people were literally like afraid to walk out the house? I mean, you were afraid to walk out the house. In fact, you know, you were, you know, some of you who like who had pets, you were like disinfecting your pets and all this and all that. And bet I was kind of telling you what it is and what it wasn't from my perspective, but you kept trying to put what I was saying into something in your life and you hadn't experienced what I had actually experienced. That's the problem, all right? That's the problem. When people tell you what you're going through and they have not, and they're not you. When people tell you, have the nerve to tell you what you are going through and they're not you. And they have no clue what has been done to you. They don't know your story. And that's why hashtag my story matters. That's good that you got it on a jacket, but I'll bet you won't give credit to where you get it because you're around those motherfuckers who that's all they do, steal and fool of you and act like you know what you going to do about it. I'm not going to do nothing. But mom and dad said they'll handle it. So I'm out here on this track with my 66-year-old ass. Welcome to Val TV. And with all the guns on me, you would think that I would be afraid to be walking into this forest by myself. But am I by myself? I guarantee you in a minute, you will see that I'm not. Hello, Holly Tree. Holly, Holly, Holly. Holly, not Hollywood, because Hollywood ain't got shit on me, motherfucking pedophilic thieves. I said what I said. Disney, you know, you're real funny with what you're doing. You're putting a lot of black faces on your cartoons and commercials and stuff like that. But do you give back the money to the black people that you take from? I'm just dropping it like that. Let's drop some truth today. I'm thankful for the truth, are you? Of course, there go the plane. I knew the plane was going to come through. <laughs> Our girl's walking. Come on, security. Do what it do. Protect our queen. I know she's a little trying sometimes stay in the house baby stay in the house i'm in the house this is my house all of this is my house all of this is my house what are you talking about linda leon what are you talking about what are you talking about what is my what is your house who told you all you own everything? Who told you you could just come in? Oh, I forgot. You got that manifest destiny going on. We want it so we can just come in and take it. We can put on stake on it. Put a flag on the moon and we on the moon. Bitch, no, you don't. Oh, I'm sorry, mother. <clears throat> can you say, can you not say that word for like one video? I will try. Look at that wonderful oak leaf about to die. Well, leaves die, and some last forever, like the leaves in a book that live on and on and on and on and on, like a good song. Not like the trash that they're trying to put on you that will last, but we all know the plastic goes fast. That's why you have all these people in Hollywood and in New York and in Florida and everywhere they go. Those plastic surgeons, you know. Those are the ones making the dough. Those in the bankers and the pharmaceutical companies. Those are your big criminals, you 
By the way, my phone stopped for a minute. I swear to God, a Russian sneezed on it and then it went black. That is no lie. That is no lie. I had to go to my people and, uh, you know, they see it, let them see it with their professional eye. That is why I love having personal relationships, real relationships with my people. I have a real relationship with my bank. A real relationship. As fucked up as they are. I have a little, okay, watch your language, because kitties. <laughs> but I have a real relationship with my bank, so when you try to, uh, try to steal my name or my numbers and try to access my, <laughs> and try to access my account, they check you, because they actually know who I am. So that's where you got in trouble. Some of you who thought you could steal from me and steal my identity. Oop, you did the same thing with my military stuff. Like, yeah, he did. Yep. Yeah. <laughs> like, Cam and Twin. You're like twins. Yeah. Twenty. Twenty. It's a good day, twenty. Now it's a good day for twenty. Oh, there go the things again. The little, the little white wiry things. There goes another. There goes another. There goes another. Twenty. Somebody said, "Girl, did you and Candace Owens wake up on the same side of the bed?" I don't know. You know, Candace Owens, that's, that's something else, yo. I can't co-sign on everything she says, but when she get it right, child. But that's that Taurus in her. I'm a progressed Taurus. When we know what we know, we know what we know, and we're dogged about it. Oh, we'll give you a show. And you better believe. One thing about a Taurus, right or wrong, they got receipts. Tell me if I don't have receipts and everything I've said hasn't come to light. Yo, to some of those people who are stealing from you, right? How you feeling? How you doing? And thank you, those who are watching out over me. I know what this is. See? But are you the good guy or the bad guy? Which wolf is feeding me? No. I feed myself. Shag it. That is true. I feed myself. I got me some coffee, some food. I'm so thankful. I got in my own car, in my own gas, in my own home. I'm going to go back to a house I actually own. Check the taxes on that. Not the bank I actually own. And I do that on my own time, in my own dime, on my own rhyme. I'm not doing any fake numbers or no fake alibis. I'm not no fake beard or scar for anybody. I'm just doing me. But I have... A real good tribe, see. It's a few, but you only need a few to do what you do. Look at that sun. Sun shine down on me. Well, oh, this is a picture, man. Wait a minute. Can I, like... Well, I'll come back and click it. Enjoy the moment. That is a beautiful scene, though. That is... Can I get it? Can I kick it? Wait a minute. Guess not. It's not the sun. Damn it. I swear. Do it again, girl. Whatever. I get it. You know, stay at the moment. It ain't about the picture or the click. It's about the trip. And are you legit with your shit? Most people are not. They took the bad apple. They took the PPP. The VIP. The bad apple. The fuckery. That we can be insta famous. No, you can't. And we can get by the IRS. You know what? Here's the funny thing about the IRS, which is criminal, by the way. Those who know know that don't know what the IRS is and what it's not. But you know what? Show people. Without a follow, without a mention, she's really piping up on this. Uh -uh. Gotta be nice for what to this? Uh -uh. Why should I be nice to anybody who steals from me? Why should I be nice to anyone who thinks they can force me into their slavery? Why should I be nice to anyone who comes from my throat like it's a joke and you think I won't smoke your motherfucker? Okay, mother. Woo! 
<laughs> Give it to Danny. <laughs> Hello, how are you? I'm doing fine. How are you? I'm out here tripping on this stuff. It's but it's cool. It's a in the day. It's beautiful. Yeah. Never been here before. I was here a couple of days ago for the first time. I heard about it, but I you know stuff. I heard about it, but I hadn't been out here. But it's lovely. How long is that? Uh, how long is the walk? So the oh. big loop. Yeah. The one we're on right now. If you just take a left when you come up here. Yeah. And continue around, it's two miles. Um, but I suggest hiking the. Um, Cypress Point Loop, which is kind of to the left of the Rockabilly House. Yeah. It'll take you behind the lake, and it's, it's the most beautiful part of it. I got it. I have to, I have to next time. I mean, you're here now, so I'm probably going to just turn back around because I got stuff to do. But I know I came out here with a friend and sometimes, you know, when you're traveling with people, mm -hmm. you don't pay attention to where you're going because he knew where he was going. So I'm like just, you know, walking around. But then I real, I turned around and I realized like, wait, because I'll sometimes get landlocked or something like, I don't know where I'm at right now. Well, it's pretty hard to get lost out here. It's, they're, they're both loop trails. You probably. It's okay, because that was the one thing, because I'm good for just like walking by myself and everything, but I was like, God, I don't want to get out here and go, where am I? What am I doing? I guess I can just depend on the animals and stuff like that, but this is so cool. <laughs> well, if you take the Cypress Point loop, yeah. you can just hike.
most part. So I know. I there's know. a lot of extra, but it's, yeah. it's a good job I'm doing. This is great when you only save it when you don't mind. Yeah. It is. And what's that house? What's that over there? So, like I said, this is a working farm. Yeah. Um, this house was Miss Betty's house. That was his cook house. Miss Betty. She lived her entire life on the property because her mom was actually the cook before she became a cook. Wow. Um, so he did have, like, this room right here to the left of the window right there. This room? Mm-hmm. So I if still... he was living in the house, yeah. he would only come down usually in the wintertime. If he was living in the house, she would stay in the house. But then whenever he would go back up north, she had a house of her own. And then that house is Miss Max's house. That's his uh, housekeeper. Miss Max. And then That's there's also Chestnut stuff. several houses back that way that were just random farmhouses of workers and um, basically anybody attaining attain to a farm work was passed that way. Wow. Wow.